a lot of you guys might have noticed. So basically, yesterday I was in a call with Lepo. He's like another YouTuber, and he's making a video on something, and he wanted me to be wanted me to be in the videos, just showing me how far he's been done with the video so far. And then when I was the call with Lepo, Pedro DM'd me, and he's like, "Donut, I messed up really bad, like really, really bad." Yeah, he said, "I I I messed up hard, really hard." Really, but really, but really. That's what he said. And I said, what happened? And he said, really hard. I said, do you want to call? He says, I'm not even joking. You can stab me right now. That's how I heard about what happened. And then I joined the call with uh, 367K and Pedro. 367K is like a, a mod, if you don't know. And, uh, you know, he's very active and everything. So Pedro and 367K were in a call together. Pedro was screen sharing our server panel to 367K. And he was like, yo... Look at this. It's we got to organize our server. We have so many different servers. We have like 20 different proxies. We have 50 different overworld servers. We have so many like different servers. And Pedro was just screen sharing through, through 367k. And he was like, yo, I need to like clean this up. So he started deleting some like unused proxies. And then at some point, he ended up deleting proxy one. And, uh, you might not think that's not that big of a deal. You know, we have like 14 other proxies. And, but the problem is that every single Donut SMP database was connected to Proxy 1. So when he deleted it, Proxy 1, literally every single database connected to Donut SMP got deleted. So think about any statistic you've ever had on the server. Think about any item you ever had in your inventory, any ender chest, any. Any money, any lives, there are no more lives, but literally everything in one click of a button, because he tried to delete the proxy, boom, gone. Like, literally everything. Like, like l there's nothing left. Ranks, deleted. We have we have people's, like, the uh, information about the ranks, like, because we have the a different, it, we have a different database just for ranks. It's not really a database, it's just we store them in a different way. And then we also kept the world so literally the only thing in the world is like people's bases are still there but inventories are gone money is gone um literally everything's gone from one accidental click of a button and then when pedro did that he was in a call 367k and like i think like half the server got kicked teleports weren't working like the money you couldn't pay people you couldn't like teleport you couldn't go to your home but so when Pedro, like, right when Pedro clicked the delete button, he was like, wait a second. The database is connected to Proxy1. And it accidentally got deleted from one click of the button. And the reason this is so bad is because everything's gone, right? We didn't have any backups. We were we were working on backups for the new season. And we didn't want to test out a new, like, automatic downloading backup system on the current season. Because we didn't know if it was going to, like, accidentally do anything wrong. But literally everything is gone and reset and deleted on from one accidental click of a button because of my mistake because I didn't I didn't tell Pedro to to make backups for the current season because we were already we were so close to the new season we we're like yeah it's fine we're not gonna need a backup so there was there's no backup everything got accidentally deleted and and uh, if you joined in, like let's say we let you guys in done S and P right now it would just be as if you're just a brand new player. Like, everything is completely deleted. We had 1.5 million joins of people who have ever joined on SMP. And the 1.5 million people, everything is cleared. And we also had a USPVP, which is a practice server. We have connected to SMP a little bit. We just have our databases running on Don't SMP. And, um, you know, all the e all the USPVP databases got reset, too. Um, luckily, the kits on USPVP were saved. But all the ranks and all the bands and everything, all the bands are reset, too. We don't know who's banned. We had about like sixteen thousand bands um of you know hackers and people who like spam racial slurs there everybody's unbanned, so we have to we really really have to make sure that we like are careful with that when we do the update um we rebanned all the like the all the really like malicious people like people who are known in the community to be like very sketchy, but other than that, basically everything is just gone everything so this happened yesterday at around like eight o'clock at night and pedro he dm'd me and i was like what's going on then we called and um 
we were like, well, what do we do? Literally everything's gone. 1.5 million players' data gone. Like the entire server just deleted in one button. There's nothing we can do. We could either start up the server and everyone starts fresh, or since we are like starting a new season soon anyway, we just have to wait. We're I think we're we were about like two months away from launching the new season about. So the Don't SP might be down for like two months or however long it might take until the new season's finished. So that's also the monthly server cost for Don't SP is very high. I'll say it's around like it's in the tens of thousands of dollars. And now that Don't SP is gonna have no revenue coming through at all, and I have to pay for the server price for no players beyond, that's losing tens of thousands of dollars straight from my bank account because of one button press but so i'm telling you guys this is not we would not do this on purpose just to for a prank or anything um and also i have no streaming content for the next month until we come out with the new season um did you pee a little bit when it happened no when it happened pedro was like he was really freaking out he was scared that i was gonna be super mad at him or anything obviously i wasn't mad because i did i actually did this if you if you guys have been in the community since like 2020 like early 2022 or maybe late 2021, you'll know that a long time ago, I accidentally did the same thing. Like I was, instead of, I deleted a server on the wrong panel and accidentally deleted Don't SMP in one button, click two, one time. But that was a long time ago and we only had like 150 players. But yeah, Pedro basically, my villagers, no, bro, your villagers. I'm sorry, bro. It's not just your villagers, it's literally everything. But yeah, I did the same thing a long time ago. And um, I know at the ne at the new season, no, this is not going to happen again because we we ha now have a plan. I think every 30 minutes we're going to have a backup created on literally everything. And we're going to have backups stored in multiple locations. But yeah, no, I'm telling you guys, if you think this was an accident, I mean, if this was on purpose, then I don't, there's, I mean, I mean, you can, you'll just see that the Dunn SB is going to be closed until the new season comes out. And uh, I have no streaming content. I don't know what I'm going to do on stream. Um, will it come back whenever the new season comes out, which means everything's going to be reset. That's what a new season is anyway. If you don't know what a new season is, that's basically everyone's already, if you, you, most of you guys probably know what a new season is. It's everything gets reset anyways, but there's a bunch of new updates and stuff. And we'll talk about the new season later. I just didn't want to talk about it today because I feel like a lot of people are just going to think that we purposely deleted it just to hype up the new season or anything. Obviously we did not do that. Is USPVP back? Yeah. USPVP, we put that back up, but, um, but uh, all the bans got reset. We just had to ban some of the people that we could think of. But um, yeah, Donut SMP is probably going to be down for a while. And when is the new season? Mm, I don't know. I was thinking before this, all this got deleted, I was thinking it was going to be two months from now. So there's a chance Donut SMP might not be playable for two months. We don't know how long it's going to take to finish the new season so that we can actually bring the server back up for you guys. But... I mean, hopefully, I mean, I hope it comes up soon. Um, My carrot farm, not cool. Yeah. I'm sorry about your carrot farm, but what's even worse is the fact that there's, we had like tens of thousands of players every day and it's just gone. That's the bad part. It's not about specifically just me who's sad. It's not specifically about that one guy who lost his carrots farm. It's literally that, but times, you know, 100,000, which is all like the active players we have or 200,000. I don't know how many active players we have. But yeah, it's going to be a while till the new season comes out. I don't know what content I'm going to make, and I don't know what we're going to do with the SMP until the new season comes out. But I just that's what I wanted to make the stage for. Um, don't get mad at anybody. It was fully an accident. I made this accident too. And I'm just saying thank you all for being here. I'm happy you guys are understanding what happened. I couldn't. I didn't really want to write this all out and just at everyone and say, don't SMP is closed until the new season. I wanted to talk to you guys and tell you about what happened. Um, so yeah, thank you. Are all ranks going to be reset? So that's like one of the only things we saved. We saved, we have like purchase data of what people purchased what. So in the new season, we'll probably, whoever like bought a rank recently from Don't SMP, will hopefully, we will transfer like, Pedro, we have that, right? We have the data of people's ranks, right? I'm, yeah, I'm pretty sure we yeah. do. Okay. Yeah, we're going to... Yeah. So we have the data of people's ranks of what they had, elite, MVP, whatever, and we'll, we're making... We're probably only going to have one rank in the new season. So we're probably just going to... um, And it's going to be like a monthly thing instead, just so it doesn't seem like it's 
like a permanent thing it's going to be cheaper for monthly instead of expensive but um we're just going to refund or not refund but we're going to give everybody let's say you had a hundred dollar rank on on stone s&p which is i mean that's the highest you could ever have which is crazy if you had that so thank you if you did but if you did have that we're gonna hopefully give you something that's worth the same in the new season and um will us pvp be up us pvp is up um start fresh that's what we have to do that's what a new season is anyway but yeah we're waiting till the new season um and with the new season we weren't planning on giving uh the ranks because we we didn't know how important that was to you guys but since we heard what you guys were talking what you guys were saying about it we're gonna give whatever you spent on dennis b we're probably gonna give you a rank on dennis b even if it, if you even if you only had the one dollar rank on donut smp we're probably gonna still upgrade you to the uh to the ten dollar thing but i don't know we'll see we don't know exactly what we're gonna do um but yeah thank you all for listening i appreciate it uh we don't have anything else to say have fun playing on uh different servers or not playing at all until it's out i'm sorry to the content creators that were um you know doing well in here like me and best take evify applied bowl delayed like there's so many different people who are streaming too all the time that now have no content but yeah thank you for listening i'm sorry it was we did not want that to happen but we'll, we're we're gonna be pushing out so much faster for the new season now so that's one positive thing the new season will be up will be out way faster but that's yeah. about it thank you all for listening and uh that's it for the stage bye everybody <laughs>